Today we are in St. Jacobs. St. Jacobs is a small farming community in the Waterloo area. It was formed early 1800s with Mennonites people. And interestingly, they came from the United States, not from Europe. However, they background German and Dutch. The town is back in on the Conestoga, next to the Conestoga River. Because there is a river, there is a work, there is a free energy and a free transportation. The town is well known from its farmers market. There is garlic. Yeah. Three, four, five days wash. But this farmers market was. Uh, oh, baby! That is really good. This is really good. The farmers buy? market was. A salad. We, you, 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 should, you should buy, yeah. Formated by the eight farmers in 1970. And since that time, it's got very big. Just be nice to buy it. Two for five. Two for five. Yeah, yeah, probably like that. Yeah, I'm gonna buy it. The marketplace has an inside and an outside, so there is a fresh parsley. Fresh that is parsley. Yeah. Inside and outside, apple. So we should go in the first row, yeah. and then when we come in, we will buy. Yeah, we will buy because it's heavy. Heavy. First you. time I see this process. <laughs> and we are in the outside part now. It's kind of cold. Oh, more cold, yeah. Well, cool. But there are lots of people. This farmers market is one of the biggest. It's like a long I believe it's only the Toronto one is bigger than this one. Hello. For you. Radish. 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 I'm sure you can find. Well, here we go. All kind of bread and bacon. All kind of bacon here. I'm hungry. I'm hungry too. Sausages. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, this one do you like? Oh, this is really good. Two for forty-five. Yeah, same with the body there. Wow. Wow. All kind of salamis. Oh, spicy. I feel like fresh. Radish, fresh. Hungaria. Hungaria. Salami. This is good, actually. Wow. Really good, thank you. We can buy that later. Very that good. is. Doggy bone. Radish, yes. Fresh. Yeah, that one is a nice one. Yes. Let's go in. Let's go in. Let's go in. So the guy that leads the process crowd could not be just got kind of racing up a bunch of the ideas and stuff. Wow, the Christmas decoration is already on. What is the date today? November? November 16th. November 16th. Christmas tree is on. Yeah. 
for what they're going to buy here.
definitely my wife heard about this Apple filter produced by this little corporation <coughs> and she decided to stay in the line that is she's on the phone and waiting for this Apple filter give it a try must be really good definitely very popular because the line is so long it's going outside from the building from inside so as I said earlier this farmer's market was formed by men of lines people in the early 70s 1975 or something like this and is still today a lot of many nice people running their business. For example, you see over there one lady deep frying some sweet things. So here from the right, the other one. They selling all kinds of goodies here. None of them is sell this. What is the surprising part of it? They're saying those people stuck in the past because they're still riding the horse food wagon yes they kept the culture but as you can see it she's working on the top notch computer which is tracking the inventory everything so they're growing there is the kitchen robot so there is a full automatic deep fryer on the end so that one is totally not true they stuck in the past. No, they did not. They kept their own culture, they a close community, however, they growing and, and doing well. You need some knowledge and you have to have your brain on the right spot to run a place like this these days. So our apple fit has arrived. So one dozen. One line. Yeah, one dozen. Wow, 1850. It's really good this one. Let's taste it. It's fresh. <laughs> mm. Really good. big piece of apple and I don't even know what kind of dough is it I used to be a donut baker a long time ago it's a different it is a really good business they have only one product and people lining up for it end of the line outside of course they can make perfect this one product they selling coffee and hot chocolate and all kind of mm. other stuff with it but there is still only one product that they make a business and make a living. Kudos to them. It's really good. It's more apple than dough. Yeah. Not too sweet. Ha. Is it hot chocolate? Yeah. I didn't put sugar. It's sweet. It's sweet already. Not too sweet, but it's good. Very thick.